recap, October 2024. This is Curtis. This is Marissa. Today we talked about swing outs. We talked about swing outs a whole lot. Um, we went to the first half of the swing out into the four. We talked about leads, making sure to not be too far away from your partner so that you don't have this coming out of the socket so that this is all nice and connected and strong here. Yeah. And that helps build the stretch as well. Yes. Follows, we talked about on, uh, going straight at your lead with gusto, is what we said, so that you're not cutting it off short. You're not stopping and then grabbing and creating a lot of roundness. You're going straight at your lead so that you get that nice stretch on a linear plane. Um, yeah. yeah. And then we talked about sitting into the stretch a little bit. We did a few sitting exercises here. And then after that, we moved on to the five. Lead stay in the step with your whole body on that. So your entire body is on your right foot before coming back around on this six, seven, and eight. Yeah. Follows making sure you feel that uh, connection in your back so that you, yep. you can do that five moment as well. Yeah. And then at the end of the swing out, we talked about uh, making the choice to give energy towards either doing a rock step versus a step step. This is for the follow. Uh, so. If there's a lot of energy in the swing out, you might want to do a step step instead of, if there's not a lot of energy, or if your lead is following you pretty well, you could do a rock step. 